Come over. Did you forget? What? If you want to join us, you gotta kill somebody. I haven't forgotten. The new man doesn't want any violence in Emerald City. So if you're gonna do the deed, make it look like an accident. Do it far away from me. I got you. and the others say they will let me in if I kill somebody. And what? You want me to volunteer to be a victim? No. I have decided who to kill, but I need your cooperation to do it. Man, that shit you're snorting is rotting your brain out. I ain't helping you kill nobody. But... No. No way, no how. But... Hey, uh, look, shut up, Mube. I'm tired of hearing your lips flap. Let me get some fucking sleep. What? My cellmate Hill knows you're a cop. Shit. How? Who knows how? He says he'll keep quiet for a price he wants a meeting. Where? The dress factory's freight elevator. Now I say we tip his chair and let him go tumbling down the shaft. Right. Fuck. Are you sure this guy's coming? Yes. Jeez, you don't know how good you got it till it's gone, man. All those times I moaned about walking the beat, I'd give my fucking right nut to be in the snow working the fucking Spick Day Parade. Okay, Mobe. I'm here, man. What you want? You think you got me over a barrel, don't you? Huh? What? So long, Butch. What the fuck are you doing, man? What the fuck are you doing? Wait, wait, let me, let me. Mobe, for Christ's sake! You should have let me tell you the plan. What the fuck is wrong with you? Are you out of your fucking mind? Lockdown! Lockdown! What the fuck happened? Someone died. An accident. Far from Emerald City. Seriously, consider moving to another cell. Relax, ready the worst is over. Yeah, right. You know, for a minute, I, I thought you was undercover. I mean, but you can't be. You know, given the amount of shit you were snorting, given the amount of shit you've been selling. I mean, it's crazy, I know. <laughs> But that night, you were so cranked up on tits that your accent suddenly disappeared. I was like, what the fuck is that? And then your girlfriend, what's her name? Kina? I was positive that I recognized her from somewhere. Tore my brain out, trying to remember. Trying to remember where. Then I had a flash. No! No! When they threw me off the roof, I was laying on the cold pavement. And this woman, police, came over to see if I was still alive. That woman, police, she's a dead ringer for your key. Well, good night, Mo Bay. Or officer, whoever the fuck you are. You talk that shit to anyone. You're next on the elevator shaft. All right, break it up in there. I'm telling nobody nothing. 
I'm telling nobody that you're a cop. A cop who breaks the law all in the name of the law. I just want you to know that I know you're a fraud. And I don't mean that you're undercover. I mean, as a person, you're a fraud. Ugh. Ugh. I murdered Bruno Guggen. What? I committed a crime. I should be punished. Why are you confessing? Because I took an oath. Because I'm not a fraud. Because I don't want to be one of them. <laughs> <laughs>